If someone tells you not to microwave food, go ahead and tell them to get out of your house, <laughs> okay? Because microwaving food is not unhealthy. And I will explain why in this video. You see, the other day I had someone in my house and they were razzing me because I microwaved a little piece of chicken. And they're like, Thomas, here you are, this health guru, yet you're using the microwave. Like, what would your fans and followers think of that if they saw you doing that? I'm like, okay, put on my education hat and explain to you the situation. Then I realized, well, wait a minute, I probably should explain this to my audience and explain this to people that watch my channel because there is some pretty legit scientific evidence that shows that cooking with a microwave is not unhealthy like people think. There's just a lot of misinformation out there. So we're gonna break it all down, make it short and sweet and simple for you so you have some ammunition to share with those friends of yours that are telling you you're unhealthy. But first, go ahead and hit that red subscribe button and hit that little bell icon to turn on notifications. And then after this video, please check out Thrive Market. So speaking of food that's microwavable, Thrive has some. Thrive is an online grocery store and I'm affiliated with them. So I've been able to create keto boxes, fasting boxes, thyroid support boxes, all kinds of different grocery boxes. So you can get foods that Thomas would recommend, literally in a grocery box delivered to your doorstep, cheaper than what you'd spend at the grocery store. It's a no brainer. So check them out in the description after we watch this video. All right, so this whole thing comes from the old, uh, there's no such thing as a free lunch aspect, right? Like if people say that always a cost to something and if microwaving food makes cooking food easier, then there must be a cost associated with it. All right, first of all, that's not always the case, okay? Take going to a restaurant, for example. Okay, sure, it's convenient, but it's expensive. So you would think, okay, it's expensive, it's gonna be healthy. Well, eating at a restaurant, even though it's expensive, a fancy restaurant, doesn't make it healthy. The point is, it, it just doesn't add up, but a fast food place might be different. My whole purpose in saying that is that whole no free lunch thing isn't always true, okay? So when we look at the case of microwaves, it's easy to think, well, it's easy to cook in a microwave, so it's automatically unhealthy. So with that in mind, let's talk about the number one thing that people would usually have beef about regarding the microwave, the radiation piece. The word radiation just has a bad connotation to begin with, right? Because we think cancer treatment, we think this. Well, microwaves are not x-ray machines, okay? It's not like you're getting traditional radiation coming out. Okay, and first of all, the waves that are coming from a microwave are somewhere in between a radio wave and a light wave, which we're exposed to 24 seven. Okay, so all the time we're exposed to this. So we're not exposing ourselves to anything additional than what we ordinarily would be exposed to. And let's be realistic here. We're getting into the 5G generation. We're about to be exposed to a lot more than just what's coming out of a microwave. So the point is, you don't really have to be worrying about that. You see, what's happening is when you're cooking with a microwave, all that's happening is little bits of frequency are causing water molecules to vibrate in the food at a very high speed, creating a thermic effect. Basically, the water is vibrating so much that it's generating heat and it's cooking the food from the inside out. And just so you know, the little screen that you see on a microwave door protects you from most of that frequency anyway, even though it's not bad to begin with. Okay, so now we have to remember that there's four things that would normally kill nutrients in food. So that's the other myth is that microwaving food makes it less healthy. Okay, you're losing nutritional value. There's four things we have to look out for when we're cooking. Okay, one, cooking with too much heat, that's going to kill a lot of nutrients, exposing them to too much heat. Cooking for too long, because that exposes them to heat for too long, which kills nutrients. Then we have to cook without blackening. Okay, so like if you're grilling or searing something, you're blackening the edges. Okay, and then lastly, we have to try to cook without submerging, because if we submerge, then we literally lose nutrients. So here's the thing. We cook too quickly, we're cooking with uh, too much heat, and that's killing off stuff. Uh, cooking for too long, exposing too much heat. Searing and grilling exposes you to what are called glycation end products, and also heterocyclic amines, which are carcinogens. So we have two things. One that wreaks havoc on your body from an oxidative stress standpoint, and one that wreaks havoc on your body from a cancer standpoint. So that's not good, okay? Or at least in moderation, right? And then the last thing is, if we boil food, then we lose the nutrients because they literally leach out into the fluid. So microwaving by triggering just this little vibration of water molecules in our food from the inside out cooks quick. It cooks at a moderately low heat, believe it or not, because it's cooking from the inside out. And it's not exposing us to glycation end products because it's not cooking from the outside where it's charring the outside. And we're not exposing it in water, so we're not draining the nutrients. So it's actually probably the healthiest way to preserve nutrients. Sure, you could dig up any dirt on a microwave, but I can also dig up dirt on a grill. I can dig up dirt on broiling. I can dig up dirt on boiling. All this stuff, you can find reasons for things to be unhealthy. But the point is, is that cooking with a microwave does not kill off the nutrients. And the most important thing to say here is it's not gonna expose you to ridiculous amounts of radiation. We're talking no more than 
a radio sitting on the counter and definitely a lot less than your cell phone sitting in your pocket. So if it's standing between you and getting healthy, then by all means, don't throw out your microwave. Use it and use it for the convenience because I will tell you, the glucose in your system and the excess calories in your system are doing a heck of a lot more damage than consuming something that was cooked in a microwave. So as always, keep it locked in here on my channel and I'll see you soon.